Hi, this is Jim from ATB. Key man insurance, a lot of people might say is, what is that? Ultimately, key man insurance is taken out by a business in order to protect itself from either loss of revenue or a capital loss uh, in the event of somebody that's very integral in the business falling sick, dying. This insurance is meant to cover situations where there's an employer that's so in integral to the business that the, there would be financial, huge financial impacts on the business should they not be around. And not being around doesn't mean that they've quit, it means that they've died, okay? So, or they've become totally disabled and they're, they're not, work, not returning back to work. If you think of an employee that uh, if they weren't there, the business may suffer 60% loss in revenue, um, or if uh, one of the, the owners of the business was to die and the IP that he holds or what he actually brings to the table that enables the business to operate would have, to have a huge impact on that business, then typically what we're looking at is that's a person that you'd want to take out key person insurance. When we're looking at how much key person insurance that we need to take out, you'd have to have a look at what the financial impact on the business would be if that person was not there. For instance, in an IT company where somebody has been integral in the development of uh, and the rollout of a particular platform and all of the knowledge rests with that person, you'd have to consider to say, all right, well, if this person was to die and we needed to employ somebody else to replace them, what would be the, the damages that the company would face? What would be the additional costs that the company would face, and that might be recruitment costs, that might be um, lead time in getting that person up to speed so they could take over where the project was. So these things all need to be considered. Typically as well, the, uh, the key man insurance is going to either be paid out on the revenue account or it's going to pay, be paid out on the capital account. On the revenue account, it will be tax deductible to the business.